At the end of its life, a massive star gravitationally collapses into its core, becoming a neutron star. A teaspoon of neutron star material can weigh as much as a mountain, so it's incredibly dense. Some neutron stars begin rotating rapidly, blasting out beams of radiation. These are pulsars. The kinds of pulsars that we use are rotating as fast as a kitchen blender. So when it spins, that beam might actually get swung into our line of sight, kind of like a lighthouse. And whenever that beam swings past, we measure a radio pulse. Gravitational waves can subtly alter the timing of those pulses. A gravitational wave might come from outside of our galaxy. It will then jostle and wobble all of the space between the Earth and the many pulsars that we look at. So we've effectively turned our little neighborhood of the Milky Way and millisecond pulsars in that neighborhood into one big detector through which gravitational waves can pass. In June 2023, Nanograv released its 15-year data showing compelling evidence for the background hum of low-frequency gravitational waves that pervades our universe. 